Faraday's Law. Faraday's Law describes the relationship between magnetism and electricity. Magnetic Induction Mr. Faraday wondered, if current in a wire can produce magnetic fields, could a magnetic field do the opposite, create a current? And his answer was yes. Actually, this was discovered both by Henry from the U.S. and Faraday from England. Induced Current Just as electricity needs to be moving to create a magnetic field, the magnetic field must be moving, or changing, to create a current. Notice this setup where a coil of wire is attached to a meter to measure current. Here's a magnet producing a magnetic field. Notice how the current is created and how it varies. Induced current observations. When the magnetic field changes, a current flows. However, when the magnetic field is constant, no current flows. Induced EMF, or electromotive force, is produced by a changing magnetic field. Faraday's Law of Induction the greater the change in flux in a wire loop, the greater the induced current. Also, less time equates to a greater current also. And more loops will also increase the current. Faraday's Law Equation The previous observations can be summarized into the following formula form. Epsilon equals negative n, change in flux over change in time. Here, flux, or phi, is once again in Weber's. Change in time would again be in seconds. n is the number of coils, and epsilon is the induced EMF, which would be in volts. Example, Faraday's Law. A coil of wire consists of 20 turns, each with an area of 1.5 times 10 to the negative third meters squared. A B field is perpendicular to the surface. At time equals 0, the B field is 0.05 tesla. At time equals 0.1 seconds, the B field is 0.06 tesla. Calculate the average induced EMF in the coil. Solution. First, we must combine our definition of magnetic flux and Faraday's law. Here's Faraday's law. Here's our equation for flux. We can substitute B A cosine theta, where flux is in Faraday's law, to obtain the following. In this case, since our field is perpendicular to the loop, zero degrees between them, cosine of zero is one. This makes our formula a bit simpler. Solution continued. Here is the result of our previous slide. We can substitute the given values, 20 turns, the area, and the time. The change in the B field is 0.01 tesla, because it goes from 0.06 tesla to 0.05. When we calculate, we get an EMF of 0.003 volts.